there's a war going on. Good versus evil. Light against darkness. Truth against lies. I'm talking about the war in your head. That person that's holding you back, that person that's bringing you down, that person is you. Are you going to say you want to want to do something? Do it for two weeks and then quit like you did last year, like you did the year before last? You say you want to lose weight, get in shape, get your business off the ground and then turn around and party, get lit, drink alcohol, eat like crap and continue to live below who you were created to be? No, no. Make a declaration to yourself. Declare all out war that you're going to get out of this rut. Decide today that you will no longer tolerate losing. You are going to be a winner. Be the hero of your own movie. If your life was a movie and it started now, what would the hero of your life's movie do right now? Do that. Do those things. Write down your goals. Write down things you want to improve. Write down things you won't tolerate from yourself. Write down things you've done in the past you never want to see yourself do again. And go forth from here as the hero of your own movie. Every day is a new day, a new week, a new shot at life. An opportunity to come out of the gate like a man possessed and attack the day without mercy. Today, I'm taking scalps. I'm putting the pressure on. I am the aggressor. I am on the attack. Because I will not stop. If you can't stick to something for five fucking days, you deserve to have a shitty life. You deserve to get your ass kicked. You deserve to be miserable. We're not talking about 50 years. We're not talking about the five years it probably takes to build something worthwhile. We're not talking about the five months it could take for you to lose 100 pounds. We're talking about five fucking days. And you can't even stick to it for that. So what the f do you think you deserve? You deserve exactly what you get. Think about all the people that say, man, one day if I have this, I'm gonna do this. What do you mean if you have this? Why don't you go out and make it fucking happen? The comfort zone is dangerous. When you're comfortable, you are at most danger. You should never feel comfortable. You should be happy and dissatisfied. But anybody ever tell you, hey, look, you know what? Just be satisfied with what you got. Don't believe them. Get them away from you. Never be satisfied with what you got. Because the attempt to get more makes you into something better. All the time. You should double your business. Triple it. I don't negotiate with myself. I don't go, oh, wait, I'm not ready. Or let me count to 10. Or maybe I'll do it tomorrow. There's none of that with me. I say you. I'm not here to discuss this with my mind. And when I say jump, you can jump. Because when you get your blood pushing, when you push beyond what's comfortable, it develops this determination inside you, this sense of will. And when you do that regularly, you're going to have a different world. You have to learn to do when you don't want to do. Learn to bring that savage mentality on yourself. The animalistic mother. You think a savage is going to about how he feels or how she feels? Then it's do it. Learn to be your best self when you're least motivated. Stop looking for a feeling to control what goes on in your life.